Hey everyone, this is Angel from Apex Gaming with a brand new video for Horizon Forbidden West. And earlier today we had a new video uploaded to the official PlayStation YouTube channel where Matthias the Jonga, game director for the sequel, gave additional details about the trailer and a couple of tweets where they officially unveiled the key art for the game and a fantastic wallpaper as well. So let's dive into all this information right now. We speculated a lot about this in the previous video, and here we are going to quote a lot of the facts that Matthias talked about, which are the following. Number one, thanks to the PS5 super fast SSD, the game will have virtually no loading screens, meaning that the fast travel and checkpoints will be available immediately. And after seeing what the PS5 is capable with the Ratchet and Clank game, this should be pretty exciting. The Horizon Forbidden West map is a little bit bigger than Horizon Zero Dawn, but players will have the ability to swim under lakes and rivers. There is no word about flying in the skies, but we can keep our fingers crossed for that to happen in some point in the game, because there were a lot of mysteries and surprises that he didn't mention. There will be dozens of new machines in the Forbidden West. Each of them will have to be scanned and studied so we can fight them effectively. There was no mention of the cauldrons, but this may indicate that they will make a return in one way or another in the new region. Some of the new machine names that have been confirmed right now are the shell snappers, that can be located in shores and swamps, the sun wings, that will patrol the skies, and the tremor tusk. We still need the names for these two that appear in the wallpaper, and perhaps we can get a little bit of information once the Horizon Zero Dawn comic book releases on August 5th, where this fella will also be making an appearance. New tribes will be featured in the Forbidden West, some peaceful and some hostile. One of these tribes has discovered the knowledge to override machines and use them as beasts of war in combat. The Tremor Tusk we mentioned earlier is loaded with weapons and heavy plated armor and can be found in the wild as well. No names were confirmed for any of these tribes, so we will stick with the watermelons for now, whom we can now perhaps confirm that they are allied with silence. The biosphere of the West is collapsing due to a red blight, not a seaweed as we initially mentioned, a red blight that infects land, choking the wildlife and starving animals and tribes. The weather is out of control, generating massive supercell storms that flood canyons and fields. I wonder if these supercell storms will have a more dangerous version of the Stormbird or affect the weather as we are crossing around the map. And finally, the launch window for the game is set for 2021, but obviously this is subject to change. And that is all the information that we could get from this latest developer commentary video. I'll keep you posted in anything that comes for Horizon Forbidden West. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you later in another video.